Onboard diagnostic systems are in most cars and light trucks on the road today. During the 70s and early 1980s manufacturers started using electronic means to control engine functions and diagnose engine problems. This was primarily to meet EPA emission standards. Through the years onboard diagnostic systems have become more sophisticated. OBD2, a new standard introduced in the mid-90s, provides almost complete engine control and also monitors parts of the chassis, body and accessory devices, as well as the diagnostic control network of the car. OBD Simulator is a device which simulates OBD2 data on CAN bus. It having the minimal hardware required to generate data on CAN bus. Hardware setup is shown in the picture. I used Arduino and CAN bus shield to make OBD2 simulator, other side ESP32 and CAN driver ICMCP2551 is OBD2 data parse. I developed GUI based software on Windows to change OBD data dynamical from the computer. You can find more information about OBD on Wikipedia. Here is the request and response data format for OBD2. OBD2 data reader needs to create a request for PID in this format. ECU will then send a response to a particular request and the format is shown here. You have to parse frame like shown here. This is PID. Here you find the information about PID. Let's see how we create OBD2 request. The request consists of 8 bytes of data. The first byte for a number of additional data is 2. The second byte for mode is 1. The third byte for PID is PID we are requesting. Rest of the bytes are either 0 or 55 hex. Now our response for request is created like this and sent by Arduino. Here we print ESP32 logs on the console. First ESP32 scan the all OBD2 PID which is supported and stores it for requesting one by one. After scan completed we found 11 soft PID here. Here is current data from Arduino. You can see the request coming on Arduino serial terminal. Now close Arduino terminal. Install Arduino OBD simulator software. Select COM port and baud rate 9600 open connection. You can now change OBD2 data from software and it will reflect at OBD scanner. 